Hi there, it's a beautiful day to be happy. My name is Mr. Tommy and welcome to my room. So today we are going to have a little showcase of ours. Um, we're going to actually have two um, events running concurrently. Um, one is our live streaming, which is currently on Facebook. And another one is this one in our small little room that's going to be recorded. So as you are watching now, you um, this is our YouTube video where our students will be able to present their speech that they have prepared for a week. And it's going to be fun and exciting. So no worries. Um, before we start, I would like to say this event is just going to be fun and exciting. And without further ado, I believe let's just jump into their speech. So the first person that I would actually like to invite onto the stage is Raphael. Raphael, hi there. Hi. Hi. So are you ready for your speech? Yes. OK, so I'll count you down in three, two, one, and then you can do your speech, all right? All right, so um, in three, two, one. Hello, my name is Raphael. Today I am going to talk about my favorite movie. My favorite movie is Turbo. Turbo is about a snail who wants to race against our supercar champion. You know, snails are slow, right? But this snail is fast. I like this movie because it proved my beliefs wrong. I used to think that snails can't be faster than a car. This snail also kept trying and didn't give up. My favorite character is Turbo. This name himself, because he tries his best and never gave up being the race car. We can be whatever we want as long as we never give up. Thank you for listening to my speech. Have a good day. All right. Good job. Thank you so much, Raphael, for that wonderful speech. Now, so I have a few questions for you, Raphael. What's the moral of the story that you have learned from the movie Turbo? Oh yes, the moral of this story is that we can be whatever we want as long as we never give up. If we, if we give up, that means we won't get anything we want. But if we never give up, we can get something. All right, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. Good job, Raphael. Now, I have a few more questions for you. Okay, um, what have you learned throughout our classes together? I learned that in the first three classes, I'm sorry to mumble, mm -hmm. but at the final class, I actually did not mumble anymore. That's good. That's amazing. That's a big, huge improvement. Now, one more question. Um, what's the best part about eBright? The best part about eBright that is that we can meet a lot of friends from other country. All right, thank you so much, Raphael. All right, now I will move on to the next participant. All right, so the next participant I would like to invite on stage is Dira. Hi, Dira. Hey, hey. Hi, Mr. Tommy. Hi there, all right. So without further ado, let's just jump into our speech. Is that okay? All right, so um, be okay. prepared. Okay, um, I'll count you down in three. Two, one. Hello everyone, how are you? First of all, I want to introduce myself. My name is Tira. I'm 10 years old. I'm from BYP, Alfredo's Islamic School, Solo, Indonesia. Okay, for this time, let me tell you about how I spend my leisure time. I love watching movies. So I used to go to the cinema every weekend with my parents or with my friends. But during this pandemic, I couldn't go to the cinema anymore. One or another way, I could only rent movies or watch it on Netflix. My favorite movie that I truly love is Harry Potter. My reason why I love it so much is because the story is fun and full of imagination, like magic. It's a fantasy movie. And another reason is because I also love the way they reveal the truth behind the story. 
Harry Potter taught me how to be strong in our life. He and his two best friends, Ron and Hermione, were very brave. Besides Harry Potter, there are another movies that I like, such as Trolls, Ballerina, Sing, Scooby-Doo, Adam's Family, My Little Pony, and Reckless Ladybug. I love the characters in that movie. And you know what? I watch it many times without getting bored. Okay, everyone, that's how I spend my leisure time. So what do you do to spend your leisure time? Thank you for listening to my speech. I hope you enjoy it. Have a great day and bye. All right. Thank you so much for that wonderful speech. Good job, Dira. All right. So I'm going to ask you a few questions. All right. So first things first, what is the moral story that you've learned from the movie Harry Potter? I learned how to be strong, how to be brave, and uh, we, uh, we, I can how to uh, reveal the truth behind the story. Mm, like that. That's amazing. Okay, give me a moment. All right, we're going to move on to the next question. Okay, Dira, the next question is, um, what have you learned from our eBright classes together? Before eBright, I feel uncomfortable for, for speak English in public. But, mm -hmm. uh, but after I join eBright, I feel more confident to speak English in public. That's amazing. You really, really honed up to the thought of like actually trying to do English. And it's amazing. All right. One more question. What's the best part about our eBright classes? I like when Mr. Tommy asks me what things that I like. It's about my idol, my favorite movie, like that. Ah, that's amazing. Well, honestly, um, doing that would actually make you comfortable to actually talk a lot more. And that's what we want to do. We want to actually be able to open up to you guys and you guys open up to us and we're able to talk a lot more. All right, good job. Thank you so much, uh, Dira. Uh, we're gonna move on. To, we're gonna move on to the next person. All right. So the next person that I would like to invite on stage is Kamal. Hi, Kamal. Hi, Star. All right. Are you excited? Are you excited? Yes. All right. Then let's just jump into our speech, okay? So I'm gonna count you down. All right. In three. Two, one. Hey there, everyone. My name is Kemal. Today, I want to talk about my favorite movie. My favorite movie is The Avenger Endgame. I like, I like this movie because the story is interesting. This movie tells the story of several superheroes named Avenger who unite against a valiant named Thanos. Thanos is very strong and wants to destroy the Earth. So the Avenger must work together to save the Earth. My favorite character in this movie is Iron Man. I like Iron Man because he is very strong, helpful, and smart. But unfortunately, he died in this movie. He was willing to sacrifice his life to save the Earth. Thank you for listening to my speech. Have a great day. Bye-bye. All right. Good job, Kamal. Okay. Now, Kamal, that was a really great speech from you. Um, I would like to ask you a few questions now. Um, so, I would like to ask, what is the moral value that you have learned from Avengers Endgame? Hmm, come on. Come on. No worries. Come on. Oh, you're muted. All right, no worries. Let's just move on to the next question, okay? All right, so the next question is, um, I would like to know, what have you learned from our eBright classes?
No worries. Take your time. Come out. Oh, come on. Okay. Um, you know what? Let's move on to the last question then. Since you're a little bit shy, let me just ask you, what's your favorite part about our classes together? Uh... Come on, come on. It when I learn with Mr. Tommy. Oh, all right. Well, thank you so much, Kamal, for the um, lovely speech. We're going to move on to the next person, okay, Kamal? All right. So the next person that I would love to invite on stage is Marcella. Hi, Marcella. Are you there? Hi, Mr. Tommy. All right, give me a moment. Let me find you so I can pin you. There we go. Okay, give me a moment. All right, so Marcella, hi there. Are you excited for our yes. speech? Yes. All right, then let's just jump into it, okay? I'll count you down. All right, in three, two, one. Hello everyone, my name is Marcella and today I'm going to talk about my favorite movie. My favorite movie is Mortal Kombat. I like that movie because it is cool and the actor act like it's real. And then I like action games so then I like that movie. My favorite character from Mortal Kombat is Scorpion. I like him because he's strong. He can save his family. And then he, he saved the world and he helps someone. That's, that is why Mortal Kombat is my favorite movie. Thank you for listening to my speech. Have a great day and stay healthy. All right, that was wonderful. Good job, Marcella. Now, Marcella, I'm gonna ask you a few questions, okay? So, what is the moral value that you have learned from Mortal Kombat, the movie? Helping people. Say it again. Helping people, that's amazing. All right, now, Marcella, um, what uh, have you learned from our classes in Ebright? Uh, I learned to be brave and trust myself. That's amazing. I'm really happy that you've grown so much. And last but not least, what's the best part about our eBright classes? When we play the game that you made. Oh, well, I really had fun with you guys. So I can't wait um, for you to learn more. I Thank you so much, Marcella, for that wonderful speech. We're going to move on to the next person. All right. Now, our favorable last person is Jesslyn. Hi, Jesslyn. Hi, Uncle Tommy. <laughs> Hi there. Okay, so are you, re are you ready? Yes. Right, so I'm just going to count you down, okay? In three, two, one. Good morning. Hi there everyone, my name is Justin and I am seven years old. And today I will talk about my favorite movie. My favorite movie is Frozen. Why? Because I like the soundtrack song and I also like Prince Ayla and Miss Elsa dress. Frozen movie tells that two royal princess. Her name is Princess Anna and Princess Elsa. Princess Elsa has a magic power. She can make ice and snow. But when Princess Elsa was in emotion, whatever she touched will be freeze into chunks of ice. And then Princess Elsa decided to make her own castle in another place. Finally, Princess Anna go to look for Princess Elsa. And she is with Krista. All of the snowmen and wood. After going throughout many obstacles, finally they got together. 
And my fourth character is Prince Anna because she is beautiful princess and cheerful and never give up and smart. That is why I love Frozen to be my favorite movie. Thank you for listening to my speech. Have a lovely day and a great day. Bye. Amazing. Thank you so much, Jesslyn. All right, Jesslyn, I have a few questions for you. Now, Jesslyn, um, what is the moral story that you have learned um, with Frozen? Um, Jesslyn, what did you learn? Mm -hmm. So, Jason, can you tell me what import, uh, what moral value you've learned from Frozen? Family important ten. That's good. That's good. Okay. So, um, what about our second question? What have you learned from Ebright? Mm. Mm -hmm. Can you tell me what you learned from Ebright, our classes? I can confide in. Oh, that's good. That's good. Okay. And what's your favorite part about our classes? I like if Mr. Tommy give us some games to me and all my friends in public speaking because I really, really like games. Oh, well, I'm really, really happy. And I've actually had a lot of fun with you guys. All right. Thank you, Jesslyn. That is our last participant from our mini showcase. And now... Thank um, you, Mr. Tommy. Thank you. All right. So thank you very much for watching this YouTube video. Honestly, uh, it was a lot of fun filming it. And it was great to have my students actually do their speech. Um, so... Thank you so much for watching this video. If you would like to know more and uh, if you would like to watch more videos, you can actually click on our channel and you can actually see a lot more. Um, please subscribe, ring the bell, and honestly, hope to see you in the next video. Take care and stay fabulous.